What I like teaching most about science, especially to elementary, is that a lot of times they don't have uh, the information and to see their eyes light up when they discover something new. Uh, we have some digital devices here in class. I have students who want to stay in at recess to look up more uh, and it's always that kind of breathless tone in their voice to find out more information that excites me the most. I've had several students very interested after people have come in in being pilots, being geologists, being doctors, uh, just because they become aware of a, a field or a um, place in the world that they might fit. They have come back later on and told me that they're taking community courses in high school or uh, getting really excited about some college courses leading in a certain direction, especially since one of the units that we do in here talks specifically about college and what they can be learning there and all the avenues that are open and they, they definitely do seem to seek out those technology fields a little bit more and the scientific fields because of the background knowledge they're learning in school. One of the favorite things with my students is our robotics program where they get to actually design robots to perform certain tasks. And the purpose of that is not to have fun in the classroom, but to show them that there's more than just math in the grocery store. There's more than math on a number line. It's math for real world, world projects. It's science that they can actually understand and change. We talk about how science is changing every few seconds, that their textbook that was good and gold when it was printed by the time it gets to their desk needs new information and they could be the people writing that new information or discovering that new information. They could be the people that a teacher 30, 40, 50, 100 years from now go, wow, did you know when they were born the internet wasn't even invented and now they have changed it so radically that we use it to perform these very basic functions and where would we be without it? They could be the next person that I mentioned 15 years down the road and wouldn't that be not only amazing but life-changing and so it's it's more than a passion for teaching, it's a passion for building futures and showing people what their future could look like and how they can make the future better.